Hey guys, welcome to another video for Greenway's Virtual Summer Camp. I'm your boy, Guppy. And uh, here we have a Minute Twitch uh, game, I guess, that you can play by yourself. And this one is called Breakfast Scramble. So what you're going to need for this is you're going to need an empty cardboard cereal box. And you're going to need a pair of scissors and a good memory. And we can also use the timer. I'm going to use the timer on my phone. So to start off, we're just going to cut off like one flat end of the cereal box. So I'm going to choose this front end here of the Shreddies box because it shows me the most picture and it looks the most visually appealing to myself. So we're just gonna cut it along the corner of each one carefully with our fingers out of the way. And if you guys don't feel as confident to do the box cutting on your own you can always ask your parents or your other family members or someone who's around your house to help you out so we'll cut this one all the way to the end and then i'm going to move it across the bottom here on the bottom corner cutting an edge is kind of tough sometimes And then we got that end, and now we look kind of like we're on a book. So this is going to be the easiest edge to uh, cut off. We can give it a bit of a fold so it has a better crease. You know, kind of like that, like an open book. And then we can just take our scissors and we're going to cut that last uh, side of the cardboard that's attached to the rest of the box. Like this. And now we have kind of like, it looks like a shoebox almost bottom half and then here we have the top half of our box so we're gonna set this aside because this we really don't need so we can throw that in the recycling or something now we just have this guy here um, I'm going to cut off the top tab here that if the box was together it would be the fold lock top that will hold the box in place but I'm gonna cut that off so we have just a nice rectangle that has no uh, parts that will confuse us when we get down to the challenge of scrambling the box. So I cut off the top flap. See you later, alligator. And that leaves us just with this cover page here of Shreddy's banana bread flavor. That's my favorite kind of Shreddy's. So now that we have this, we're just going to cut some really fancy shapes into it at just like random. So however you feel is good. So we can do one over here and we'll do it like a little bit of a curvy one. And then that's my first one that I cut out right there like that. So it looks like this together. It looks like that apart. And I'm just gonna put this right here in the middle of the table somewhere where we can see it and not lose it. Cause we're gonna need all these pieces that we cut out. Next, I'm just gonna go off that one. And I think I'm gonna do a little bit in and a little round spot like that. And then yeah. So then we have another funky shape there. We have this piece down here. Um, and if you have some spots on your cardboard that are like that kind of, just make sure you don't snip these parts off because that'll make it even harder for us to put all this back together, which is the point of the breakfast scramble. So then we can do some kind of regular square shapes that might make it a little bit tougher too because if we have a bunch of squirrely thing swirly things like this one and then we have one that's just a square it doesn't look like it's going to match up to the swirly one right but it will fit into that spot that we have right here so next i'm just going to do a squiggly chop like that we'll cut that guy off um let's do a a confusing one I'll do a little bit of a wiggly line here with this one and then I'll cut it in half so each time that we have kind of a piece of cardboard we can cut it so that it's tougher for us to put back together like a puzzle next I'm just gonna come through here I'll do a little bit snipping here and there and then I'll unsnip it I think it would be a lot of fun to kind of make this one the shape of a bean. That looks like a jumping bean. Looks like a bean from this side. 
Um, and we're just remembering to keep all of our pieces of cardboard we cut out right here in front of us so that when we put everything together, nothing's lost. So I think I'm gonna do like a big shape here. And I'm gonna come back in this way. And you guys can cut these cardboard shapes really however you want. So in this one, I made a big heart shape. Because we've made some triangles, we've made some squares. Now we have just the spiky piece here that I've also made. And then... We're just gonna cut up the rest of this so it's nice and mixed up from the other things that we made. Got another nice long triangle there. I think I'm gonna chop this one like this. Yeah, I think that looks right. And I'll chop this one like that. And then this one I'll leave on there, but I'll do a squiggly line chop through here. And maybe I'll take an end off of this guy over this way. And now, and that'll be my starting piece right in the middle. We have a bunch of pieces that are just all mixed up together. And they're going to be here in a little pile like this. So once you have your full box cut out, this is when you can grab your phone or your timer or a stopwatch or anything you really have. For myself, I have handy my cell phone. We'll set that to one minute on the timer. It's tough for you to see. And then I'll set this over here. Okay, and I'm going to press start on the phone so that the timer starts. And then I'm going to put this together as fast as I can and try and get it so that it looks like it did before we chopped it off. So here we go. Three, two, one. Here we go. Alrighty, first I have our shreddies piece here, so I'm gonna place that down. I'm gonna try and build it so that it's facing you guys. That'll make it a little bit tougher for me, I guess. Um, next, I'm looking for, hmm. I guess how I would do a puzzle is I like to do a puzzle by starting with the outside. So I'm gonna look for all the flat edges I can find, and I'm gonna see if I can start it that way. So flat edge, flat edge. This is a flat edge that looks like it's attached to this flat edge. Oh yeah, okay, I found one spot right here. This is a piece that goes together. Um, that is not a piece I think goes there. Hmm. I hope I can beat this in a minute. Next, I'm looking for a piece that looks similar to these other pieces here. I know this triangle piece might go here because it looks like it fits and it does. Next, I'm looking for... <gasps> oh no! Well, that was a minute, and I only got like three pieces together. So let's keep this going. I'll start my stopwatch, and I'll see how long it takes me to get this done. So I'll re-scramble everything. And I'm going to put a world record for my own self putting this together. So I couldn't make it in one minute, but I did a couple of them in one minute, and I'm sure you guys will be able to do yours in one minute. But here I'm going to set a record, and then that'll be the time that I want you guys to try and beat is my record. So I'm going to start now and just start going at it. Alright, we have the heart. After the heart, I'm looking for something that says shreddies. Okay. Now, something easy to remember is that if you have things like letters, like on my cereal box, um, if you try and remember where they go, or if they have like different things, like with this piece here, I noticed that shreddies is together. So I noticed that it looks like they almost match together. I'm talking, so it might make my thing a little bit longer than I was thinking it might be. Hmm. 
that doesn't fit. Oh, but that fits. Hmm, interesting. Okay, next we're looking for this piece. Oh, yeah. All right, here we go. I'm starting to get this thing together. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, no, oh, no. Oh, yeah. Banana bread flavor. Okay, we're getting in there. We've reached one minute, so I wasn't able to beat that one minute for my second try. Um, next, I'm looking for a spot where shreddies would be poured into a bowl. Ooh. Ooh. This piece is going to go over here. Okay, I think we're getting into spot here. I'm going to grab this boy. Yeah, boy! We got that piece in. Um, this piece. No, that piece doesn't go there. Looking for a piece that has a little red spot that looks like the post symbol. Oh, this boy here. Yeah, boy! Alrighty. We got that in place. Next, I'm looking for... Oh. Does that fit here? Oh, that does fit here. Okay. Okay. Alright, okay. Alright, okay. Um, why? Oh, there we go. I get it now. I get it. Okay, next is this piece from what I understand. Now we gotta grab this piece. It goes here. And then this piece, I'm certain is this bottom corner piece. I just have to find out where all these other pieces fit in. This piece sits here. Okay, square piece, where are you at? Square piece goes here. This guy here. Um. Oh, 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 we are almost done. And we are. Bam, finished. Three minutes and nine seconds for me to do a full one. So that's how quickly I was able to make my shreddies puzzle. I'm going to spin it around and reassemble it so it's nice and together. And I'll show you guys how it looks in puzzle formation. And there we are. Our shreddies puzzle. Yeah. So that's what our breakfast scramble looks like. Thank you guys for joining me for this video, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.